Hello everybody, I'm Andre here with another episode of the AF Podcast, the Anal Fuck Podcast, and I have with me here Richie. Richie, it's good bro. Not much, how you doing? Is that not much? Yeah. You look you look nervous as fuck. Chill. Chill. <laughs> anyway, so how you been bro? You been good? Uh, yeah. Yeah? Uh, yeah. Uh, so we're gonna get straight into it, like, straight into it, like, we're gonna start banging right now everybody. Anyways, um, let's talk about our past. Like our past, like remember our past experiences, our oh yeah, the, the gay relationship we had for a bit. Of course, <laughs> um, we both went to the same middle school. That was yeah. right. That was right, dude. Uh, he was copying my look really badly right now. No, nah. you were, you were. No, nah, you took my look. That's I had really good. No, I had short hair actually. I had short. I was in a short, but it was like still like not as good of a hair. But my hair was, uh, he had really long hair. It was like yeah. luscious as fuck. Down to the shoulders. Explain how it was. Explain the daily grind of the hair. <laughs> it was a, it was a process. That's why I cut it. Uh, it was just really long. I had to brush it every morning, conditioner. and I had to wash it like every three days. It was. You had, you had to come in your hair, bro? Of course, yeah. <laughs> that looks so silky. Oh, yeah. I remember you walk around like school and you had like the long hair and shit. I was like, damn, that guy's sexy as fuck. I want to do it. <laughs> And I, I got my own, I got my hair longer, but that was like after, after, but yeah. yeah. And uh, it was cool. We, we'd known each other for a while, except we've never like had any classes. Yeah. That's, yeah. That's one weird thing. We, we've talked for a while and we've never had a class together. I know. It's a shame. Yeah. Is it just because you don't give a fuck about me, bro? No, what? Come on. It's <laughs> talking shit. So I started talking shit. So what's with the, uh, the beard going on there, bro? You got, we're just talking about facial hair. Is, that's all we're talking about. Facial hair, bro. <laughs> it's uh. It's there. I actually got to cut it soon because uh, I went to my like, job orientation yesterday at Burger huh? King. Uh, mm-hmm. And they were like, yeah, it's too long. And I was like, fuck, tell fuck. me. So even Fucking that's bullshit. too long? Yeah. yeah I, that's what they said. I was like, that's crazy. Yeah, I'm right. not going to cut it. I can oh. kiss my ass. So. Oh. <laughs> fired, <laughs> fired, boy. <laughs> fuck that. Oh, that's insane. The, you got the hair ponytail going. When did you start with the ponytail? Um, well, that's a funny thing. When I had uh, the long hair in, the, uh, in mm-hmm. middle school. I actually went to this first, mm-hmm. and then I didn't like it, and I cut it during the summer, so then I cut it all off, and then... Then you came back to it? You, yeah. just, you just missed something about it? How does that work with the bitches? They love it, honestly. They love it? They, the long hair, yeah, they, they like it. I, I, I know, I've had experience. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's how it'd be. How come you don't have any glasses or some shit? I don't know, we're just talking about... I, I have a really good eyesight, actually. You really like, do? Yeah. It's like 10 you out of 10? You don't need shit? No. Oh, fuck. Damn, this place gets good. What, yeah. When did you add the uh, the ear shit? Sorry. Oh, I got those. I don't even know. Like the first time you started wearing it. Like eighth grade. Eighth grade. Yeah. Uh, that's when he became a fuckboy. Then. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think the earrings make you a fuckboy. I think. I don't know. That's like a whole, a whole, society shit. Yeah. The the whole fuckboy uh term is. Mis misused. It, it's misused. To oh, a lot of lot. guys sometimes, yeah. So, uh, how many niggas have you beat the fuck up with? Beat the fuck up? I actually haven't been in the fight since I've gotten to Florida. Oh, sh- are you serious? Yeah. I haven't that, fought that, no one that's since. A, that seems like a fucking lie. I feel like you've beaten nah. so many people up. No? No. I Every time I've tried to fight someone or anything like remotely close to that, it's... No? No one does anything and they walk away. Dude. So, how, how many people did you fight, though? In your past times. Oh, before I came to Florida, I was in I was in Jersey, and uh, I, I lived in like the not nice parts. Oh know? shit! So like, yeah, it was like almost every day where I, like I'd be in like two or three fights. Oh fuck! Yeah. How was it like like on a daily constant? And you always like beat the fuck out of somebody. So someone look at you weird. You like fuck them. And like, well, I, I've never gotten my ass kicked. Like I I mean I've lost fights like uh-huh. close ones, but like I've never gotten my ass beat. It's mostly me just beating ass. <laughs> beating ass and eating ass. You beat them up and then it's your victory. You get to eat their ass. Eat the girl's ass. I eat the <laughs> girl's ass, yeah. Have you ever, like, punched, a, like, a chick before? Like, Oh, no, 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 no. I would never. I mean, when I was younger, I like, me and my sister used to fight. Obviously, okay. every, everyone does. Yeah. But I've never, like, hit a female. Oh. Like, is that is that the boundary? When is it, like, do you, like when, when when would you hit a, hit a hoe? Like, if a chick is just losing shit and she's just going, ah! Honestly, um, I, I mean, I, like... You gotta hit a hoe. Some some chicks need a good slapping. I don't know, like... If they hit you more than, like, three times hard mm-hmm. in the face, 
they deserve to get like a little something. Mm-hmm. Honestly, like the only time I would ever hit a girl, like ever, is if I walked into my house or like my apartment room mm-hmm. or some shit. And she was there with another guy. Oh, shit. I'd beat the shit out of the nigga, and then I'd, <laughs> I'd hit her at least twice, and then that's it. Dude, she'd be fucking dead, bro. Just, like, done. I should, yeah, because it's, like, my house and shit. You can't do that. It's my house, bitch. Get the fuck out. You could have at least, like, done it somewhere else. Oh. I wouldn't have been that mad. <laughs> yeah, I don't care you're cheating. Just not in my bed. <laughs> it's disrespectful, yeah. <laughs> oh, dude. That's, 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 an, you, damn. I, f- I don't, I don't want to, like, cheat on you, bro. Like, ever, ever. <laughs> Fucking, that's a warning. I've, I've never been cheated on. You never have? No. Then how have you, like, been broken? Just, like, mutual. I don't love you anymore. It's, uh... Rest in peace. I don't know. Sometimes, uh... I just like the wrong girls. You just yeah. like the wrong... Like, you fuck around with them thoughts here and there. Like, you didn't know there were... Th- I don't... Some, yeah, exactly. Dude, I don't, there I are don't. some thoughts that are in secret. They were, like, a chameleon, bro. Like, they're fucking camouflage. They look all nice and innocent, yeah. but they're fucking thoughty as fuck. And then they're fuck. not, yeah. Oh, shit. That's insane. That shit sucks, yeah. They're like, hi, nice to meet you. I'm a fucking thought. Take out your cock. You know? Like, be gone, thought. That, that's exactly how it is. They, you uh, you start to like them. You start talking to them. And then it's cool. And then... The next thing she takes out a titty, I'm like, whoa. No, it's not even It's not even that. Like, I mean, that's cool Like, if she wants to like get into it like that. Like, oh, but, shit. Like, I'm ready. F- when you find out like what she's doing when she's not with you and stuff, that's Ooh. what sucks. Yeah. Ooh. How do you, how do you come to terms with that? How do I find out, or how do I like how well, do I deal both, with it? Both, both, both. How do you find out? Hold on. Do you go I, like? Do you have like a private investigator check no, out your I, girlfriend? I, um, I know a lot of people, and I also know how to how to use social media. Oh, you create like a fake fake fuckboy account? <laughs> nah, not I don't not not even anything to do with like fake accounts. Like I I straight up just I'll go on like one of their pages or whatever, and I'll, I'll look around uh-huh. and I'll I peep shit. <laughs> Or I'll just have people tell me that are, <laughs> are close to them because I'm friends with a lot of people. You know, not. Yes. I talk to a lot of people. I have uh, I have connections and stuff, but that connection to the underworld, and all that shit. Yeah, it's got fucking the mafia and shit behind. <laughs> are, exactly are you, are you you're Italian, right? Yeah, dude, you fucking like a mafia and shit, right? Oh yeah, yeah of course, dude. You gotta like Italian people always got shit going down. You know what I mean? <laughs> Especially if you ever been to like a fucking Chinese restaurant, bro. They got like. Secret meetings in the back. You know what I'm talking about. The Chinese people? Yeah, the Chinese yeah. people. The Asians, bro. Yep. It's fucking them, dude. In the background, I just want to go back there and be like, where's the meetings at, you know? I just want to go to like... um. they probably kill you with oh. chopsticks. <laughs> <laughs> fucking those fucking dudes, the fucking uh, sushi shit. Fucking get the nice. I just want to go up there, like do like maybe like a prank or something. Just go there and yeah. just be like, I'm a table for two. And I'll be by myself. I'm like, <laughs> no, table for two. You know, and like give them a wink, and they'll be like, "What the fuck are you doing?" But you know, there might be a chance they might let you in the back, and then you go back, and there's like a whole bunch of like cigarette smoking in the back, and you know, or a big orgy. Oh you fuck yeah, <laughs> the Asian orgy. There's like a whole <laughs> bunch of like Asian dudes. Asian dudes are weird. Asian dudes are weird. Yeah, like, there's uh, like a whole bunch of old men. I've never seen a tall Asian dude. They're all fucking tiny as fuck. Besides like Jeremy, Jeremy, whatever the fuck his name is. I don't know. In the NBA. Oh, oh I don't know. He's I'm tall not, as fuck. I don't keep any track with any of that shit. Neither do I. <laughs> then why did you? Just <laughs> <laughs> I just know about it. I don't know. Oh, that's that's how it'd be sometimes too. Yeah. Oh god. But um, so let's talk about your footballing. This this boy's a football player. Yeah. Oh yeah. Talk about talk about that. Talk about your journey to becoming a football player. I'll sit back and like masturbate. Uh, I'm not sure if like, do you watch when like you're at the games and stuff? I watch. I mean, I'm there. I think I'm I'm there in uh in the, in the action. How how would you describe me as a player? Well, okay, truth be told, I don't know which one's you, bro. There's so many yeah, people. there's a lot of people. <laughs> I, there, yeah. I know. I'm just like, I'm like, that guy got to tackle. Good job. But I, 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 I mean, I see you guys are all like pumping out and sweating. You're like oh, yeah. giving like all you got. It's, it's hard work, yeah. I, I don't know. I I actually, I haven't, pl- I've never played football until sophomore year. Never? Never. Never like. Never put on a helmet, shoulder pads, nothing. But did you ever like throw balls or something? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I used to, um actually before I played football here. I used to go to uh, Jessica Clayton Park mm-hmm. every uh, Saturday at, like, 1. Mm-hmm. And they used to do, like, flag football tournaments and stuff. So, like, I, I've always played football, but I've never, like, actually, like, played, played. Yeah. You know? And I, I've, I've always liked it. I've played video games like Matt Madden and stuff. <laughs> Hit up that Madden. Yeah. None of that Fortnite shit? I, I, I don't fuck with Fortnite like that. <laughs> like, I'll play it once in a while, but that's about it. It's like, if we're talking about games here for a minute, and specifically Fortnite, I think it's a good game it's just the fan base is just fucking done i can't deal with the kids yeah it's just little kids little kids and little, shit. very annoying and you know yep. sort of like uh rick and morty is a good show but i think it's been 
tamed by everybody. Same thing with like Minecraft. It's like a decently good, you know, fun game. But exactly. But the kids just like, yeah, cringeworthy. They, wanna... they they all jump on the uh the bandwagon or whatever. Yeah, yeah, whatever the wagon is, you know. And <laughs> whatever the they, wagon. They ruin it. They ruin it. It's just fucking yep. disgraceful. Just want to. Dude, that's hot. These little girls, bro. Like, not even little girls. Like younger than us, but like girls our age and younger. Like mm-hmm. they all jump on to like the. Like, what they see on social media, they think they have to oh, be like that. Dude. And that just annoys me. Dude, it fucking pisses me off. Like, yeah. for example, growing up, the girls that we knew, they were modest to a certain degree, you know? Exactly. But now they're just shaking their asses and shaking them titties. And I'm not going to lie. Like, yeah, guys like that, and it's cool. Yeah. But, like, me as a, like a, as a nigga, bro, like, <laughs> I want a girl that respects herself just as much as she respects mm-hmm. everybody else. I, I'm not trying to have a girl that's, like... Posting her tip pics on fucking Instagram. Like, I'm not fucking with that shit. Miss me with that fucking thought shit. That shit, yeah, exactly. Be gone, I don't thought. fuck with hoes, bro. I don't. It, I feel bad now. Like, if I ever have, like, um, kids or whatnot, like, there's going to be so much thoughty shit. I'm like, be gone, thought. Oh, yeah, no. My 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 kid, like, my my son is going to be a fucking stud. Because <laughs> I'm going to teach him the right way. So, and, like, okay, you do like this. You talk to her. You listen to her very carefully. And yeah. my daughter, she'll, uh... She's gonna be. She'll be strong. She's gonna. She, she's not gonna have no fucking. She's gonna be a saint. None of this. None of this. Her first boyfriend better come around when she's like eighteen. I don't want to <laughs> hear about anyone else before that. Dude, that'll be insane. You gonna. Uh, you gonna like um, discipline your kids like hard on them. You gonna be hard on them. I mean. It. it I don't want to be hard on them because like. Ten kids and stuff and like I know how it is. To, how many kids are you wanting? Just like a boy and a girl. Like two or three. Two or probably. three. Two or three. Once you find the right. Woman, that's not a fucking thought. Exactly. That's and that's another, bro. With girls, bro, it's like no chick wants to marry anymore. That's insane. They just want to fuck. No, no, no. I, I, nah. That's more the guy. girls look for the guys to have like a, a like a long relationship with. Yeah. It's just girls are very uh like they set their standards too high. You know. Oh uh, yeah. They 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 look for something that won't be there, and then you know. As soon as you don't deliver to it, they're just like. Or they find something that's. That they think is like what they're looking for, and it's it's not. It's fucking fake, yeah. fake and gay. <laughs> exactly. I um, hate I hate that shit, dude. You see, I feel like you've been like this this man. He's like all old and wrinkled, and just like you just so much knowledgeable experience. <laughs> I can just sit back here, just take off the podcast, bro. Just go at it. I, I don't know. I just I I've been through a lot. I I know a lot about different situations. It's so like you've had you've been in a situation where like the girl you go and take her home, and all of a sudden she takes out her dick. <laughs> I've never no, I've never <laughs> dealt with a, a transgender, but I I know when the time it's comes. It's a tranny or or like a tranny, right? Some some, some shit. I don't some, know. some fucked Honestly, up. Honestly, I don't know. Some fuck, fucked up name. Some and fucking pansexual. I, I seen um, some shit on Instagram the other day. There there's seventy six different genders. Miss me with that gay shit, boy. Yeah, there's two. There's male there's, and there's female. female. There's nothing in between. There's three. Male, female, and mentally ill. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Why do people get offended by that shit though? I don't. I don't even. They can't get offended because, honestly, you're doing it to yourself. You're trying to change yourself. You know That's... what? Like, I always talk about this. Like, okay, if someone wants to say you, you offended me, like, I want, okay, there are some people that I see that are, like, really, really, really true SJW feminists. You know what I'm talking about? What's SJW? Like, social justice warrior. Like, she's, like, really, really fat. And she's got, like, pink hair or some shit. And she's like, let me speak to your manager or some shit. Like, you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> no, what the no? fuck are you saying? Oh, okay. Well, you know what I mean? Like those bitchy, bitchy, bitchy bitches. Okay, okay. You know, yeah. like you offend me, you know, yeah. that type of thing. Like I've never like met any. Like, I know a girl like that. I, I met like two or so in the past. And I've always tried to get off on her. Like go crazy. Okay, so this is one time, right? Okay. So here's something that a lot of people are like, what the fuck? They talk about the pay gap, that there's a pay gap, that men make more money than women, okay? Yeah. But they all they did was just take a survey of men and women and how much they make, and they compared it together, and like, well, men make more than her. They also don't take into account the fact that women ha- who get pregnant, they take time off for their children, okay? And women tend to go on lower-paying fields and stuff like that. Yeah. And there's a whole lot of statistics backing up that it's, it's not even legal, to pay a woman less. If women get paid less, then why aren't more women like in every job then? In that case, it would be like, let's hire more women because yeah. we can pay them less. It's not true. Anyway, so there was this feminist that I was sitting next to, right? Okay. And she was just talking about like, oh my gosh, uh, you know, and she's talking about like the pay gap. I'm like, you know, that's not true, right? And she's like, what? I'm like, 
It's not true. No, uh, you made a mistake. Dude, I'm like, I was like, it's not true. You know that, right? And I said, you know, statistics and stuff like that. She's like, you know what? It's like, it's not true. It's not true. You know, she's like, that's no, not true. I'm like, uh, it is. She's like, and she's like, get away from me. Yeah, she get, freaked out. Dude, she's like, get away from me. And I was just like, okay. I was like, I'm like, she didn't provide any evidence. She's just like, you know, it's not true. You know, and this is fucking weird, bro. These yeah, bitches. Yeah, I, I, know, I know a girl like that. I mean, she's not so much into like, like the job shit and mm-hmm. all that, but like, I don't know. She she gets offended with like very little things, you know. Like one time, I I uh, I uh, spit my piece of gum out, mm-hmm. right? And we were outside, and uh, she freaked the fuck out. <laughs> so spitting your gum out? Yeah. For <laughs> why? What's the reason? She, I don't. I guess like feminists and girl like they don't just like push for like girl power and like mm-hmm. she's strong it's, into it's... like the global warming and shit. She was like. You know how much you just hurt, like. Oh, like, get out of here! I was like, I no, don't do this to me, like. Don't, don't please don't. Yeah, you know how many people litter a day, like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like it sucks to say, but like, me and you won't be alive right. when the world dies. Yeah, it, it sure. does for sure. So for you sure. gotta, you gotta, I don't know, you gotta. It's insane, bro. Like, what are you supposed to do at that point? You just, I, like, I don't, I don't even know. She, she was tripping though. Like, she t- tripped heavily. <laughs> It was bad, bro. Oh, bro. Oh gosh, that's that's insane. How did how, oh did you just like did you stop talking to her? <laughs> no, no. I mean, I I wasn't. She, it was my boy's girl at the time, but like, okay. I don't know. I like, and the thing is, like, she's not like one of the girls that you think would be like insane like that. She was like a chill, but she's like yeah. Let the fans. I mean, I she's still cool. Like, I I just I now when I'm with her, I gotta be very careful with what I say and stuff. <sighs> Fuck that. She'll snap, dude. She's. Let the hoes go ho go hoeing, bro. It's it's crazy. I do. I hate I hate hoes, bro. This hoes dude, it's, it's insane, dude. How do you, okay, I I can't deal with that. Oh man, ah, uh, I just want to I want to get in a fight, like not purposely get in a fight, but just just destroy them with their shit. Like that offended me. Well, the fact that you're saying that offends me. You yeah. know, just play their game against them. They said you did that. That offends me. The fact that you're bringing it up offends me, or some shit. You know. It, I I go hard. I go hard on them, bro. That'd be insane. Usually when I, I did this, I always say this. When I argue something, mm-hmm. you better know I'm arguing for a reason. Mm-hmm. I'm always right. <laughs> if I'm arguing, no, I'm right. Mm-hmm. I I won't argue f- if I'm wrong. <laughs> if I'm wrong, I won't say anything. Oh God, that's that's good. Yeah, that's good, bro. I I I use that all the time, bro. You fucking. This is wisdom right here, guys. <laughs> I'm I'm done with this. I I, I don't I don't need this podcast anymore. Fuck this shit, bro. Fuck this shit. Um, so, how? What's your plans for the future, dude? Oh, it's funny you say that. I, uh, <laughs> I've been going through a rough time with what I'm gonna do oh. after, like it's gonna sell drugs and shit. <laughs> um, <laughs> I think you can become a male prostitute, be a porn star, bro. Catch diseases, <laughs> Daddy Richie. <laughs> I don't know. I'll uh, Poppy, Papa Rich, Papa Richie. I want. I want to go to um college for football, obviously, but like. Isn't that like really hard to do? It is, yeah. You need you need grades. You need to be good, and I, you need the money obviously to pay for it. And mm. I don't got that. So I mean, if that if that doesn't work out at all, then uh, I'm actually gonna try to go to trade school to get like my cosmetology license to cut hair. Oh yeah, yeah. To cut hair, he's gonna be a stylist. Are you gonna go gay on me, bro? No, 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 no. Like a barber, like a okay. barber. Yeah. Okay, and they're like, okay, not, so not we need a hair. To, um, yeah, none of that shit. Mm. I mean, you spice it up a bit, oh, you yeah, know? Yeah, none of that shit. <laughs> I work in a barbershop, not a hair salon. Okay, that's good. That's good. I'm like, yeah. messing with that gay shit, bro. Yeah. How the mighty have fallen. <laughs> All right, dude. That was that was good. So um, what what did we learn today? What did we learn today on today's podcast? What did we learn? I don't know. What did you learn? That Andre Fernandez is a cool-ass guy. <laughs> well, I learned that Richie... Richie's good. <laughs> Richie's good. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> uh, yeah. uh, I think I learned a lot about you know your upbringing. You, you're Jersey boy. You're a little bit Jersey. You got you yeah. got a little bit of Jersey accent. Right? That's not even the right accent, but you know. That's close. I'm sorry. It's, it's, uh, fuck. <laughs> 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 All right. Well, that was good. Good talk with you. Hopefully, we can fuck again some other time. Of course, yeah. Anytime. All right. That's it, everybody. Take take care. Take 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 care. You say say goodbye. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we both. <laughs> All right.